Deer antlers. 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 Deer with the Quran and, and authentic uh, hadith. Uh, yeah. Um, I don't have to take Quran here. Okay, well this one, book 7, number 2721 of Sahih Muslim. Aisha reported Allah's messenger, may peace be upon him, having said this, five are the vicious and harmful things which should be killed even within the precincts of Haram. Rat, scorpion, crow, kite, and a voracious dog. Hey, you've heard about those animals in the Old Testament, how those are like the bad animals. Rat, scorpion, crow, kite, and dog. Well, I don't know. They didn't really mention dog in the Old Testament, but... This hadith has been narrated on the authority of Zuri with the same chain of transmitters that she, Aisha, reported. The messenger of Allah, may peace be upon him, commanded to kill five harmful things in the state of Iram, or otherwise the rest of the hadith is the same. <coughs> I like this one. It says, this is how it is. This is a good interpretation. God appears to Moses. And Moses went up to God, and they were literally called to him from the hill, saying, Send us to the house of Jacob, and from the children of Israel, you have seen what I did to the midst of him, and lifted you on the wings of eagles, and brought you to me. So now, if you listen to my voice, and keep my laws, then you shall be to me a peculiar people. <coughs> People of the earth, and you shall be to the royal priesthood and the holy nation. These are the words you shall speak to the children of Israel. Okay, Zaid B. Jubair, he reported a person asked in Umar which beasts of Amurim could kill. Thereupon he said, One of the wives of Allah's ap apostle may peace be upon him, told me he, the holy prophet, commanded to kill rat, scorpion, kite, voracious dog, and crow. Crows aren't that dangerous, are they? The divine manifestation of Sinai. Maybe it's not because they're dangerous, they're just like, not... Like, oh, they might be possessed by devils, a crow. You want to get rid of that yeah. crow. When the third day came to the doorway, there were voices and lightnings and a heavy cloud over the hill, and the sound of a powerful trumpet. So that uh, all the people <coughs> in the camp trembled. And Moses brought up from the camp all people to meet God, and he sits them below the hill. Is a kite and like a weird animal? All over its surface. Is when a kite a weird bird or what is it? And its smoke went up like the smoke of a smelling furnace, smelting furnace, and the whole hill trembled greatly, and there was the continuous sound of a trumpet. The Moses very boldly spoke, and God answered him by a voice. Then he ever living hey, to say, You know in the Old Testament when they got a kite? And they say you're not you're not supposed to eat a kite. It's like one of the evil animals that you're not supposed to eat. What's a yeah. kite? Like some kind of bird? I don't know, a kite? Yeah, like when you fly, fly it's like when you fly a kite. Yeah. It's in the Old Testament, I'm reading it in this hadith right here. It says five are the beasts in killing which or they're being killed, there is no sin. Crow, kite, scorpion, rat, and voracious dog. <laughs> 